Some people in one valley neighborhood say some target shooting on the desert is getting a little too close to their homes. 13 Action News reporter Marty Glazer spoke with neighbors who now want to draw a line in the sand before somebody gets hurt. I've never heard this in my life um, this close. Cell phone video given to us by Michael and Lauren Dufries. One, two, three. Showing what they say they heard at 1.30 Sunday morning. Gunshots. I, I have, I own a handgun. I know what it sounds like. Um, and I heard five to ten shots. 45 caliber casings. Whoever loaded that handgun left a fingerprint. The DeFries say those casings were found just 50 feet from the back of their home. Now, in addition to those 11 shells the DeFries say that they found behind their house, they say police found about 13 shells right here. Now, that's about 90 feet from an elementary school. That school, Robert Forbes Elementary just one day before students walk through the front doors. A family that has two children, um, like fourth grade and kindergarten, and her husband's deployed. She's home by herself. She called me and she said, Lauren, did you hear that? This is just really hard to go through this. And my husband is even more scared now because he can't, there's nothing he can do from where he's at. So <sighs> that's it, it's just very hard. And as the president of the Homeowners Association, Dufresne says it's his responsibility to keep his neighbors safe. This has never happened before, and I, and I don't want it to happen again. Marty Glazer, 13 Action News. Metro got back to us on this story a few minutes ago. They say there were calls reporting gunfire in that area. They've taken the casings into evidence. No one was hurt.